right, let's play Full Throttle Remastered. New game. Good man, Lucas Arts. It's like I'm 10 again. Whenever I smell asphalt, I think of Marine. That's the last sensation I had before I blacked out. The thick smell of asphalt. And the first thing I saw when I woke up was her face. She said she'd fix my bike. Free. No strings attached. I should have known then that things are never that simple. Yeah. When I think of Marine, I think of two things. Asphalt and trouble. Rip Burger, you're dumber than dirt. Oh, Mr. Corley, if you'd only listen to my plan, my vision. I know your plan, Rip Burger. You're waiting for me to die so you can take over my company. Well, sir, that's horrible. I am not waiting for you to die. You know I've never liked you, Rip. But you have business know-how and killer instincts that I respect. Why? Thank you, sir. But this latest idea of yours, riding up to our shareholders' meeting with a gang of bikers? Who do you think you're fooling? The shareholders, sir. It's good PR to be seen hobnobbing with real Corley Motors customers. What do you know about our customers, Adrian? You've never even been on a bike. Well, you know I'd be on one right now, sir, if it weren't for my destabilizing inner ear condition. Ah, your ears are fine. It's what's between them that scares me. Now there go some boys I can ride with. Step on it. Let's find out who they are. <laughs> hey, Ben. Mm. You know, Ben, we're broke. Yeah. And if some cash doesn't come our way soon, we're in big trouble. Relax. I have a feeling something's coming our way. Something big. Yeah, you better stay out here, Rip. This place is bikers only. 
<laughs> All right. Who's the guy that drove over my car? What could possibly be taking so long? Maybe old man Corley got himself in trouble. Yeah, maybe they took the old guy out back and worked him over with a two by four. Hmm, an appealing notion, but improbable. More likely he's boring them to death with some tale of the glory days. <laughs> but Malcolm, isn't that illegal? Not back then it wasn't. <laughs> so who do you ride with these days? He rides with me. Although I'm sure he'd much rather be riding with your little club. I told you to wait out in the limo, Rip Burger. I thought you might like some help with your sales pitch, sir. Sales pitch? Yes. We have come here today to offer you and your men employment. Mr. Corley requires an escort to the annual Corley Motors shareholders meeting. Does this look like an escort service to you? You would be well compensated for your time, of course. Not interested. It's uh, fairly obvious that you could use the money. Listen, I said we're not for rent. The polecats are not goons for hire. Not even if it were Malcolm Corley's dying wish. Rip Burger! That does it! I'm gonna... Hold on there, Malcolm. If you don't mind, I'd like to step outside with Mr. Rip Burger for a little chat. Excellent idea. And the doctor says he only has a few months to live. That's bad news for all of us. He's not just a nice guy. He's also the last motorcycle maker in the country. What happens to Corley Motors if he dies? Don't worry. I have a plan. And if you come to the shareholders meeting with us, you'll find out what it is. No dice, Rip Burger. The Polecats are not thugs for rent. If you want to buy muscle, you should go find the rot wheelers. The old man says it's the Polecats are nothing. Then I guess it'll have to be nothing. Hmm. And that's your last word? That's it. Well, I'd like to make you just one final offer. <sighs> Bolus, take this coat and go get his motorcycle. We'll have to tie up this little 200 pound loose end. <laughs> It'll need to look like an accident. That stuffed shirt actually thinks I'll leave him in control of Corley Motors when I go. Boy, is he in for a surprise. Hey, where's Ben going? Your colleague has decided to accept our generous offer after all. As a matter of fact, he's gone on ahead to scout out the route. He did? Well then, let's roll him, boys. Yahoo! Corbill, here we come. There is a render mod from the old version. You can play with a gamepad as well. Warning, do not play in or around dumpster. Do not kick dumpster. Do not sleep in dumpster. Usage of this container for disposal of human remains may be a violation of local health ordinances. I'm not putting my lips on that. <laughs> I'm not putting my lips on that. I've woken up and worse.
Empty boxes. He really should flatten these so they can be recycled. They're empty. I've woken up and worse. Well, the bike is there. The kickstand. I'm not putting my lips on that. It's empty, but I can see the bartender in there. Open up. Open up. We're going with a foot. I uh, fixed your door. <laughs> it was sticky. Look, I don't want no trouble. Just leave me out of this mess. I've never liked nose rings. Me neither, but someone dared me. Looks like you're out of customers. Yeah, your gang talk off with those, those well-dressed gentlemen. So what'll it be, Mac? Where's everybody head off to? Where'd everybody head off to? What am I, the cruise director? Maybe they're up on the Lido deck. <laughs> I think you're in on this whole bum deal. Yeah, well, what are you gonna do about it? What do you have? Who knocked me out? I want to know who knocked me out. Maybe you just passed out. You should learn to handle your liquor. You want something? What do you got for a headache? A little sympathy. Thanks. But not much. The monitor doesn't have any controls. The monitor doesn't have any controls. The monitor doesn't have any controls. Yeah, the signal is piped in from Kickstand National Headquarters. Those might look good mounted on my handlebars. Nah. Those might look good mounted on my handlebars. Nah. Man, I wish they had a jukebox. Yeah, right. Man, I wish they had... I don't have anything. I don't have anything. I don't have anything. Ah, booze. Can't. Gotta ride. <laughs> Hmm. It's empty. Don't get any ideas. <laughs> Good thing Ripburger didn't touch my bike. Good thing for him. I'm not putting my lips on that. Good thing Ripburger didn't touch my bike. Good thing for him. That's where I came from. Nothing that way for me but a warrant. I'd never catch up to them on foot. Some joker took my keys. I don't like that. <laughs> You 
want something? Where's the keys? I'm looking for my keys. I have no idea what you're talking about. Where are the keys for fuckivity? You know what might look better on your nose? What? The bar. <laughs> now don't mess around with me. All right, all right. I got your keys, but I don't know nothing. They had guns. They told me to stall you as long as possible. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I overheard them say something about an ambush up the road. What else? Nothing, nothing. Look, man. Here are your keys, all right? Oh, uh, someone did say something about killing you and making it look like an accident. They didn't do too good of a job there. But why ambush the pole gants? I'd better get moving. Hmm. No. <laughs> Too bad you can't drag him again. hit the road, we own it! Look, I'm serious. Someone's ambushing the pole cats. Someone's ambushing the pole cats? Oh, heavens! Whatever will we do? Ha <laughs> ha! That does it. Come on, kitty! Let's get down! Don't you... <clears throat> I don't know what's wrong with the devs today, oh, man. I'd like to make you just something about killing you. It's so freaking hard to create a good game. Something about killing you and making it look like an accident. Especially with the story. They had guns. Malcolm Cole is dying. Something about an ambush up the road. I have a plan. Oh. Man, this is gruesome. My editor better print these in color. Now I have to get you some help, I suppose. Oh. Ah, quit moaning. I know someone around here who can fix anything. What are you? I'm a mechanic. And apparently a pretty good doctor as well. My name's Maureen. My name's Ben. Why did you hit me over the head, Maureen? You were in an accident. A reporter found you and brought you and your bike here. My bike? What have you done with my bike? Brought it back from the dead. Sort of like what I did with you. I need a little help getting it finished, though. Who are you? Maureen, remember? If that's too hard, maybe you should just stick with Mo. Do you have a last name? I prefer not to use it. What about you? Same deal. 
then it's Ben and Mo forever, I guess. This an authorized Corley Service Center? Now you could call this a Corley Service Center, but I don't have the official paperwork. Ah, an illegitimate Corley operation. I prefer to think of it as a renegade Corley operation. Where'd you learn bikes? I grew up working on them with my dad. One summer we did nothing but restore this old hard tail together. I mean, we scrubbed every bolt until it shined. But he took off one day and he never came back. So I switched to toasters. You live in this town? Well, Melonweed's not much of a town. What's left of it is sinking about a foot a year. People either learn to adjust or they leave, which is fine with me. Not a people person? I'm just better with toasters, that's all. You seem more concerned with me than your bike. How's it look? It looks better than it did, but you gotta help me out. The front forks are wasted, so you'll have to get some new ones. And someone stole my welding torch. Can you believe that? I can't finish without one. And last but not least, I patched up your ruptured gas tank, but you're out of fuel and I don't have any. Where am I supposed to find all this stuff? You can hack it, tough guy. Where am I going to find new forks? Well, they don't have to be new new, just not broken into little pieces. You can start by asking Todd in the trailer across the way. He runs the junkyard. How am I supposed to find your torch? I don't know. Set up a dragnet. Still can't believe someone would steal my torch. Who around here would do a thing like that? Where's the gas? Well, there's a whole tower full of it at the edge of town. I have this crazy, irrational intuition that tells me maybe it's worth checking out. Actually, I think I can handle it. Good. I don't have any money to pay you with. Hey, this one's free. I haven't touched anything besides a toaster for so long. Getting my hands on your hog has really been a pleasure. Well, thanks. Don't sweat it. I gotta get out of this town, fast. Trouble with the law? Not in this county. Then what's the hurry? Someone tried to kill me. I'm after him. Why would somebody want to kill you? To get me out of the way so they could ambush the polecats. We better get this bad boy back on the road then, huh? Well, I'll let you get back to work. Let me know if you need any aspirin or anything. Is there a safe? Shop five percent. Ah, nice and easy now. Wish this gas can was full. We got a gas can for the gas. Who's this? Oh, that's me and my uncle Pete. He took care of me after Dad split at this place he called the Mink Ranch. When he died, he left it to me. You're a mink farmer? Nah, that place went belly up long before he died. But I still go back there whenever I need to get away for a while. Do you have a fly? Just to kill it. Wait, what? I hate seeing her like this. Why? It's really my best side. I'll wait till she's done. Oh, 
good. You're not dead yet. I might still get a quote. I heard you saved my life. Yeah, but don't worry. I wasn't trying to. I was just looking for some nice roadside disaster photos and you helped. Who'd want a picture of me bleeding? It's not the blood. It's the way you were, all twisted up like a pretzel. Listen, I've got to stop an ambush. Ambush? Really? Where? Somewhere between here and Corville. My crew is escorting some VIPs to the Corley Motors shareholders meeting. And there's an ambush waiting for them somewhere up the road. Um, uh, I... I... Yeah? This is hard for me. I... I need... Come on, man, spit it out! Uh -huh. Could you give me a ride in your car? I've got to stop this ambush. You're right. We have to get to the ambush, all right. But I'm afraid I'm without wheels at the moment. How did you get us here? Hitched. Well, I'd better be going. All right, drive safe now. Pretty small to be carrying me or a... I rolled you. <laughs> Find us a ride yet? No. It's empty. I don't want to hurt Moe's mailbox. quote for you. Tough-looking padlock. I couldn't break that lock. I couldn't break that lock. Either someone's doing some welding down there, or we're talking about some very sub-code wiring. Smells like burning metal down there. Hmm, no. Smells like burning metal down there. Mama's face has dripped down into the dirt. But I'm steel bars in the glass. It's even sadder looking inside. Apparently, this guy has a dog. No thanks. This sandbox has been taken over by a big dog. No thanks. This sand... I'm not putting my lips on that. Who's out there? Hey! 
I'm trying to do my art in here, buddy. I don't got time to waste on bums like you. Hey, you lousy nobody. Some boy who loved him. <laughs> Open up. What do you want? I'm a friend of Moe's. I need... Listen, I didn't take no welding torch. You hear me? I'm no crook. So get off my back already. You not... This is important. Not to me, you freaky looking hood. Now bait it. Get away. Let me in. Ha! Ha ha ha! Good one, punk. You stick around long enough and maybe they'll pick you up with a trash. I'm about to roll this tin can. That's it. I'm calling the cops. Good. I've been meaning to report a stolen welding torch. The population... Eh. Hey, dirtbag. I ain't home. Get a life. Candy Graham. That's it. If you don't take off for good, I'll... You'll what? I'll glaze your ugly push with my welding torch. I mean, my, uh, my hairdryer. I'll get out my hairdryer and burn you, so beat it. What do I have to do to get rid of you? Hey, dirtbag. I ain't home. I... Building inspector. No dice. <laughs> get away from my door, you bonehead punk. Got some flowers here. Scram! <laughs> I don't got time to waste on bums like you. Can I use your phone? <laughs> you knock for a reason or you just nuts? Get up! I'm here to look at the art. <laughs> nice try. Get away from my door, you bonehead punk. Hey! I'm trying to do my art in here, buddy. Hey! You've won something. Let me in. Give it up. <laughs> I got a guy coming to look at my yard. So blow. What are you? Quick. The whole trailer's on fire. Hit the road. You stick around long enough and maybe they'll pick you up with a trash. <laughs> Hi. I'm from Mobile Manor Magazine. <laughs> Get your greasy, oily, leather-wearing carcass off my property. You not... This is the police. <laughs> Enough already. Get away from my door, you bonehead punk! You knock for a reason, or you just nuts? I'm selling these fine leather jackets. <laughs> Get your greasy, oily, leather-wearing carcass off my property! You knock for a reason, or you just nuts? I take it all back. Now let me in. <laughs> nice try. I got a guy coming to look at my yard. So blow. Get a life, you... Don't make me come in there. Give <laughs> it up. You know... I'm getting angry. Hit the road. <laughs> I don't... Come out here a second. I want to show you something. Scram! What? Hi. I'm from Mobile oh, I, I Magazine. That's what I was, I was wondering. <laughs> so look, where we go? What do I have to do to get Oof. rid of you? Who's Man. out there? Hey! I'm trying to do my art in here, buddy. Yeah, you lousy nobody. Some boy who loved him. Now we're in. Oof. This view defines true beauty. Looks like a cabinet to me. It's a lockpick. It's empty. Chill, man. I haven't had a good life like this for a long time. Better hustle this back to Mo. <clears throat> That's it.
past my welding torch. How'd you get it? Oh, it was just lying around. A pair of forks, a little gas, and we're set. Oof. <laughs> I had a dog with a funnel on its head when I was a kid. I don't collect art, and I also don't collect whatever that is. Kick the little tin doggy, maybe later. I hope he's not trying to bring these to life or anything like that. I don't want to start a fight with that thing. Has dripped down into the dirt. Not a bad version, really. But I'm still chasing. Chitlin's whiskey and skirt. Ouch. I don't collect art. I could try, but it wouldn't die. I nominate that as least offensive of show. I don't collect art, and I also don't I'm not putting my lips on that. We got a lock pick. Let's see if we can pick up uh, a lock. It's either dog food or this guy's dinner. Nothing else in there but stains. That's not one of Meat's many uses. Heavy looking. Open up, Todd. That's not one of Meat's many uses. Motherfucker. The 
A gas can. That's not one of Meat's many uses. A gas can. That's not one of Meat's many uses. Apparently, this guy has a dog. That's not one of Meat's many uses. I need something heavy. I think he's had enough. I think he's had enough. This view defines true beauty. His decor has a strong carnival coin toss flavor to it. Wouldn't look good on my bike. No. His decor has a strong carnival coin toss flavor to it. I hope he's not trying to... I don't collect art. I don't want to start a fight with that thing. That would make a good mailbox post in hell. I'd rather just get out of here. I don't collect art. And I also don't collect whatever that is. Can't get up there. I don't collect art. And I also... Ouch. I don't collect art. I could try, but it wouldn't die. I don't... Co and I also don't collect whatever that is. See if we can go anywhere else. The population is greatly decreased. Probably all that's holding this dump up. They'd just fall apart. It's even sadder looking inside. Not on foot. I don't walk. I need to find something heavy. I don't want to hurt Moe's mailbox. She's got her hands all over my bike. Jealous? Mo. Yeah, Ben? I'm having a little trouble finding stuff. What's the problem? Where's the gas? Well, there's a whole tower full of it at the edge of town. I have this crazy, irrational intuition that tells me maybe it's worth checking out. Mm. Where am I gonna find new forks? Did you try the junkyard? Actually, I think I can handle it. Good. Well, I'll let you get back to work. Let me know if you need anything. Hmm. This hose smells like gas. A hose won't help here. It's what I use. A 
hoes won't help here. Oh my god, and what will? A gas can won't help here. A hose won't help here. A hose won't help. A hose won't help here. A hose won't help here. But sugar, I won't let it go to my head. A hose won't help here. Has dripped down into the dirt. A hose won't help here. It's not something I want to lock. That's not something I want to lock. That's not something I want to lock. That's not something I... That's not something I want to lock. I keep discovering new stuff, but truth to be told, I don't know what to use where now. Todd's junkyard. Open up, Todd. Oh yeah, I knocked him out. A hose won't help you. That's not something I want to lock. What could I lock? A hose won't help. That's not something I... A gas can won't help here. That's not something I want to lock. The population is greatly decreased. And now the odds are greatly increased. That's not something I want. Someday get a chance to kiss your lips. Nothing else in there but stains. It's empty. Oh, 
hose won't help here. A hose won't help here. A hose. That's not something. That's not. That's not. A hose won't help here. That's not something I want a lot. It's already open. A gas can won't help here. A hose won't help. Mm -hmm. This hose smells like gas. Mm -hmm. This hose smells like gas. A hose won't help. That's not something I... No thanks. This sand, no thanks. This sandbox has been taken over by a big dog. I'm not putting my lips on that. That's not one of meat's many you. That's not. A hose won't help here. Probably all that's holding this dump up. That's not something I want to... A hose won't help here. Mm, did I miss something at the beginning then? I hate seeing her like this. Why? It's really my best side. I hate seeing her like this. Why? It's really my best side. I, I don't walk. Not not on foot. I, I don't walk. See if I can mix items. You can mix items, like in Monkey Island. I mean, I checked everything even without Ferrari. This is what I missed. The top of this fence is electrified. No. That's not something I want a lot. A hose won't help here. I bet that thing's full of gas. If only I could get in there. That's not one of me. A lockpick won't. 
A gas can won't help here. Is it like this and then I can't do shit? I mean, not much I can do, it's gonna raise the alarm. Let's see if I missed anything here. Ah. Ah. on that. Just the kind of forks I need. Not one of meat's many uses. Oh. And what is it? <laughs> Ooh, fire damage. Forget about it. Dogs. 
it's empty. It's empty. Dog jumps in car, eats meat, jumps out, kills me. Dog jumps in car, eats meat, jumps out, kills me. for the dead bots. Thank <laughs> you. 
<sighs> you can't even look at that fucking hell. Down. Bad dog. Make a fucking step down. Meet dogs. Not like I have that many options, okay. This is to fill up gas. A hose won't help here. I still don't know what a hose is for. Take it back. What for? I need it for the dog. What the fuck? think that I need this to lock the, the dog. It's irritating as it gets right now. Just the kind of forks I need, right on top. A hose won't help here.
it's empty. Holy shit, for real. Where am I now? Aha, uh -huh. oh, finally. I hope it worked. I'm glad the hell did this spot this. No. If it doesn't work now, look how freaking far he is. What are you doing? Hey. How did you get down now? I'd better get out of here. I'd better get out of here.
<clears throat> nice forks. Where'd you find them? Right next to the knives and spoons. Just gotta gas her up and go. won't help. That's not something I want a lot. There's nothing I can do over there. Absolutely nothing I can do. Darius. Business. empty. Get out of here. Ah, uh, uh, junk. I love the smell of junkyards. Ah, uh, junk. Ah, uh, uh, it's empty.
It's empty. Man, what the fuck now? Yes, I know I can't pass over there. The hose should be for some of the cars, yeah, but they're all empty. That's one ill tempered mongrel. I'd better get out of here. One ill tempered mongrel.
junk. Mm -hmm. This hole smells like gas. Wish this gas can was full. Wish this gas can was full. Cycles never die of old age. Ah, uh, junk. 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 Uh, junk. I'm not putting my lips on that. Ah, uh, junk. Ah, uh, junk. Ah, uh, junk. Ah, junk, ah, junk, ah, junk, ah, junk. can won't help. It's empty. Wish this gas can was full. Hmm. This hose smells like gas. It's a lockpick. It's empty. A gas can won't help here. I think it's not for here. But I tried everything, it's not those cars. Not one of them would have gasoline. Maybe it's like that. Because you can't click on it. Where are you? Hey, where is he? I nailed him last time. But who set off the alarm, Floyd? Maybe someone is just fooling with us. No, it's him. It's that guy you keep missing. Well, if you could hold this thing still while I'm shooting, I'm going down for a closer look. I don't see nobody. He must have run away. Nah, we would have seen him running from the air. He must be hiding up in the tower. We got him treed. Let's go up and get him. That's to be guess here. I don't trust anything without wheels. I'm not putting my lips on that. I don't touch anything with it. I don't touch anything with it. A hose won't help. A gas can won't help here. Don't think so. Oh my god, now what? A hose won't. Wish this gas can was full. A gas can won't help here. I'd say that's where the gas goes. Aha. 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 
that. Uh... Hey, who's that down there in the yard? It's Sam. You get it. This Where? is a gift. Over there. Muting in the You go around the other side and we'll have him cornered. Like, no. Where'd it go? Let's call it quits. The minute every day. No. Let's call on reinforcements. <clears throat> oh, good. You get this from the gas tower? Not exactly. Well, that's it. Wait outside for a minute and I'll finish her up. I'm working on a surprise. I hate surprises. All right, here she comes. Am I cool or what? You're amazing. I should crash that thing every day. So what's the surprise? Oh, just your average, everyday, pre-regulation destroyer class solid fuel recoil booster. You're serious? Yes. But only the vultures. I have my connections. Now, are you gonna try this thing out or not? Ooh, I wish I had a camera. I wish I had some way of paying you back. Just beat it, will ya? You're scaring away my regular customers. Bye, Mo. Send me a postcard from the ambush. Maybe I trigger the alarm if I can. You hear that? He's back at the gas tower. He's got a lot of nerve, that piece of trash. Let's get him. All units, follow me. Ben, how'd you get behind us? Where are the suits? Corley's making a pit stop. He has a bladder the size of a thimble, man. Ripburger? Haven't seen him in a while. Ben, man, what's the deal? Did you find something up the road? Are we headed for trouble? No. We're in it. <laughs> Put my head in a basket Cause I'd had a tank full When she blew my gasket I surely was thankful Till I head for the skies up above It's a woman with wheels that I love <sighs> Come on, old man I gotcha Now, do something incriminating like ambush somebody. Aha, the plot thickens. You shouldn't have laughed at me in those board meetings, Malcolm. What a psycho. Gotcha. Hey, look what I found in the bushes. What is that? It's a chokehold. Come here and I'll demonstrate. It's got a camera. 
I'll get her. No. Nestor will take care of her. You have an important engagement with the rest of the Corley family. Right. But don't forget to destroy that camera. Yeah, yeah. Now then, Malcolm. How about one for the road? Corley? Corley. Ben! <coughs> I guess Rip Berger couldn't wait for natural causes. Just like him to hit a man when his flies down. <coughs> Rip Berger did this to you? Yeah, he knew I was dying, and he knew that my will would put him out of a job. He wants to take over Corley Motors, Ben. Sell it off to foreigners, lay off workers, start making minivans. You understand me? Minivans! Oh. <laughs> <coughs> minivans. You gotta hurt him for me, Ben. Promise me, you'll hurt him bad. I promise. <coughs> I want my daughter to take over the company. You have a daughter? Yeah, and she's a real mechanical genius, Ben. Rebuilt her first carburetor when she was four. Eh, I used to call her the diaper dynamo. <coughs> Find my daughter, Ben. Find Maureen. Maureen? The blood tickets. Ripburger's way ahead of me. I just hope Maureen can handle herself until I get there. Hmm. Gun, I understand. Why do you bring a camera? Who does this guy work for? Corley Motors? Nestor, what's that moving over there by that pile? I don't know, Rip, but I think that pile is Bolus. <sighs> yes, now I remember. You're the smart one, aren't you? There's Moe's shack, but I don't see the limo. Maybe I beat the thing. On second thought, maybe I didn't. <laughs> uh, look how great the writing is. Jokes, atmosphere in the game and everything and then. It's not only this, it's Monkey Island as well, it's Broken Sword, it's Green Fandango and whatnot. The Last Journey, Siberia. There's a lot of great adventures and now you translate that to those AAA titles of today when you wanna try and create a story. Man, it's like comparing a real writer to, to children these days. Everything devolved, man. Instead of evolution, it's devolution. Looks like someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris, except for that smashed up camera. Backs open. No film inside. Hmm. Mo said she didn't have a camera. Here's Mo's picture of her and her Uncle Pete at his mink ranch. She said she went there whenever she needed to get away for a while. That's pretty much my only lead right now. I'm not putting my lips on that. Looks like someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris, except for that smashed up camera. Here's Moe's picture of her and her Uncle Pete at his mink ranch. She said she went there whenever she needed to get away for a while. That's pretty much my only lead right now. Looks like someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris, except for that smashed up camera. Not on foot.
this sucker's mine. <laughs> Look, I really need a ride. Look, I really need a ride. Hey, killer. What? Hey, it's cool. Your secret's safe with me. What secret? Haven't you been watching the news? Once again, our top story tonight, Malcolm Corley, owner of Corley Motors, was found dead at a rest stop just outside the town of Melonweed. Apparently, the benevolent patriarch and CEO was viciously beaten about the head and neck, savagely and without mercy. Police have arrested a notorious outlaw biker gang known as the Polecats. No. With the exception of their leader, who is still at large. Roadblocks have been set up along Highway 9 in an effort to apprehend this dangerous and violent criminal. We've been set up. Roadblocks suck. I shouldn't have left the gang there. Hey, I don't want to hear anything about it. You ain't making me an accessory after the fact. Just lay low, man. Members of the Polecat Gang are in custody, but their leader remains at large. Authorities have issued an all-points bulletin. They got the Polecats. He doesn't look happy. Seem to have a lot of time on your hands. Not to mention nicks and scratches. <laughs> Am I distracting you? I can do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. That's your truck out front. I need a ride. I look like a cabbie to you. Get lost. They're not letting anyone through that roadblock anyway. Not even truckers? They turned me around, said police business only. Pigs. Look, I really need a ride. Not gonna happen. Why? Because you're afraid of some cops? No, because I don't like you. I just killed a guy. I'm just about to. I don't think that's good for the table. Hey, Quahog. Yeah, Emmett? I'm gonna be knifing up your table for a while, all right? The customer with the knife is always right. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Good talking to you. Friendly folks you get in here. Damn, it's not what you'd call an I'm okay, you're okay person. Ah, shut your hole, Quahog. He's got a knife. He's got a knife. Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you I don't want to get involved. Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you, I don't want to get involved. Ever hear of this place, Uncle Pete's Meek Ranch? Well, uh, I remember there used to be some sort of weasel plantation or, or something up the road. Down Highway 9 on the other side of them damn roadblocks. I used to pick up meat meat there real cheap and sell it to school lunch programs. <laughs> that was a good scam. I need to get to this place, Uncle Pete's Mink Ranch. I need to go in that direction too, but the pigs are running the sty at night. How poetic. No.
Look, I really need a ride. What do you do now? God damn, not here again. I'm not putting my lips on that. It's empty. I, I don't walk. Returning to the scene of the crime. They'll be coming this way soon. I gotta get a plan. Fast. Sucker's mine. Not not on foot. Over here. Psst. 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 Ben, no time to talk. You know, it's stank in there, but I can't remember a better sleep. You gotta help me. Go find my editor in Corville. Tell him I took pictures of the Corley murder. You got pictures? Yeah, but some thug took my camera. So you don't have any pictures? Hello. Well, I tracked the guy to Melonweed, but I'm not going near the place. They kill me! Get my editor! He's gotta get me out of this! Take one of these fake IDs to get through the roadblocks! My career is riding on those pictures! Help me, Ben. You're my only hope. Oh, don't worry. I owe you one. If Miranda's thug is the same one that trashed Moe's place, that could be Miranda's camera I saw there. But then, who's got the film? Pretty mediocre fake ID. Hope no one notices the correction fluid under the name. Let's see. Guys. It's midnight. I'm done for today. We're gonna continue tomorrow. I'll install another game as well as Loop Hero as well as Full Throttle to play until the Lords of the Fallen is out. I'm gonna go have a dinner. My wife prepared a dinner. And I'm off to bed. I, I woke up early. People, next stream tomorrow. Or better to say next stream in around 16 hours from now. Guys, thanks for watching, and I wish you all good night. See you back soon.